Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Please allow me to thank the Italian Embassy for hosting this important workshop today and His Excellency Ambassador Michel Caroni for his kind invitation to be part of today's workshop, which truly affirms the major business partnership in the energy sector and the amicable ties between the Egyptian and Italian governments. It is a pleasure to be part of today's event, especially with the presence of such a distinguished group of speakers and guests discussing one of the most important topics in our industry nowadays, which is the pivotal role of natural gas in facilitating energy transition. Egypt's oil and gas sector considers energy and the transition to low carbon sources a core element of its sustainable development strategy. Egypt's Vision 2030, issued in 2016. Accordingly, Egypt's energy sector is addressing the energy transition along several pillars to unlock the full potential of its low carbon energy sources. Oil and gas resources represent a main source of energy in the world and will remain part of the global energy mix over a long term. Natural gas has a pivotal role in facilitating energy transition as the cleanest hydrocarbon fuel and for providing affordable, reliable and clean energy to support development and sustain the li livelihood for societies. Egypt took a strategic decision more than 20 years ago to gasify the economy and natural gas has increasingly became Egypt's fuel of choice. Back in 2018, Egypt was able to achieve self-sufficiency of gas and resume exports through major gas development projects such as Zohr, West Nile Delta, Norus and Atoll. Consequently, Egypt became one of the largest gas producers in the region. In 2019, Egypt was ranked second for natural gas production in the MENA region and in 2020, Egypt was ranked 14th globally. In the fiscal year 2021-2022, our natural gas production growth rate massively increased by 50% compared with 2014-2015. Natural gas consumption increased more than threefolds since the year 2000 and now accounts for 65% for the total consumption of hydrocarbon fuels in Egypt up from 40% in 2000. We expanded our household natural gas con connection projects across Egypt's governorates to increase household access to reliable, lower cost, grid connected natural gas supply. We have connected 13.5 million household units to natural gas grids during the past 42 years, of which more than 50% were connected during the past eight years. Additionally, our domestic activity of using compressed natural gas, CNG, in vehicles rapidly expanded, especially with the support of President Initiative for vehicle conversion to run on compressed natural gas. In this respect, the sector succeeded to convert around 440,000 vehicles to date, of which more than 50% were converted in the past eight years only, rating a 53% increase since 20 uh, 2014, with a plan to convert additional 300,000 vehicles by the end of 2023. Moreover, we have also been able to both resume and ramp up our LNG exports through our two LNG facilities in Itku and Damietta. I'm very proud to mention that Egypt broke LNG exports record as exports during the first four months of 2022 represented the same revenues of the total exports achieved during the year 21, reaching close to about $4 billion. All these developments and achievements throughout the past eight years paved the way to transform Egypt to a regional energy hub. Today, as we witness the global energy challenges, we need to emphasize the necessity of sustaining global and regional partnership 
to withstand the energy market's turbulences in the course of the current political tensions. To this end, I have also to highlight the important role of the East Mediterranean Gas Forum in enhancing regional collaboration between the East Mediterranean countries by being a platform of a structural policy dialogue between the region's gas stakeholders. As my words come to an end, I would like to say that natural gas is not merely a transition fuel, it has become the fastest growing energy source in the world, helping countries achieve energy sustainability, economic growth, and preserving the environment. I would also like to seize this opportunity to thank everyone behind the achievements of the Egyptian oil and gas industry, our success partners from the Italian companies in Egypt and our Egyptian oil and gas sector's human capital who are surely one of the reasons behind this success. I wish you all a very productive and successful workshop and thank you.